Today we will learn classifications of triangles. Let's start this video with an interesting question. Here are some figures. Can you identify which of these figures is a triangle? You may pause the video and try to find out. Have you chosen figure E? If yes, then congratulations! You have correctly identified the triangle. To correctly identify a triangle, it is important to understand its concept correctly. Triangle is made of tri plus angle, which means a figure that is made of three sides. Therefore, we can say that a figure that is made up of three sides is called a triangle. In the given figures, only E is made up of three sides. Therefore, only this is a triangle. Along with three sides, a triangle also has three angles. In different triangles, we see that the measures of sides and angles are different. To understand triangles better, we classify them on the basis of their sides and angles. So, let's first learn the classification of triangles based on the sides. Look at this triangle. If we take the measurement of its three sides, then we will know that all its three sides are not equal. Such triangles whose sides are not equal are called scalene triangles. If we take the measurement of its angles, then we will know that its angles are not equal. In this way, we can say that all three sides of triangle are not equal, then its angles are also not equal. Now look at this triangle. If we take the measurement of its sides, then we find that two sides of its sides are equal and the third side is not equal to its other two sides. A triangle whose any two sides are equal is called an isosceles triangle. If we measure its angles, then we will know that the angles opposite to equal sides are also equal. This means that two sides and two angles of an isosceles triangle are equal. Now, look at this triangle. On measuring this triangle, we find that all its three sides are equal. A triangle whose three sides are equal is known as equilateral triangle. If we measure its angles, we find that all the angles of such a triangle are also equal. That is, all the sides and all the angles of an equilateral triangle are equal. Now, let's learn how to classify triangles on the basis of angles. Here, three triangles are given. Can you find any difference by looking at their angles? Try. If we look at triangle ABC, then all its angles are acute angles. If we look at triangle PQR, then it has two acute angles, but one right angle. Similarly, in triangle LMN, we can see that there are two acute angles, but one obtuse angle. With this understanding, we can classify the triangles in following ways. Triangles in which all angles are acute angles are called acute angle triangle. Triangles with one right angle are called Right Angle Triangle Remember that the right angle of a right angle triangle is represented like this. Therefore, if an angle in a triangle is given like this, then you can easily identify that triangle as a right angle triangle. Similarly, triangles in which one angle is obtuse angle is known as obtuse angle triangle. Today we have learned classification of triangles. In the next video, we will learn some examples related to this.